Hey there, Heather. Hello there, it's Jeff Cutter Diary. Welcome you to the Al Adels PC Replay Basketball Tribute Match. So, a lot of people are like, who the heck is Al Adels? Well, I'll tell you about Al Adels through his Wikipedia page. Born November 7th, 1936, died August 20th, 2024. He was actually a pretty good point guard and selected by the Warriors franchise when they were in Philadelphia before joining them when they went to San Francisco in 1962. He was player coach in 1970 and remained as head coach of the Warriors for a while, helping them win the NBA title in 1975, which was a shocking one because Washington was heavily favored to win, but they did it. Golden State not only beat Washington, they swept them in four straight. He stepped down as head coach in 1983 and basically was employed by the Warriors the rest of his life. Ambassador and CR representative. They even retired as number 16 in 1977 and inducted to the Hall of Fame in 2019. That's amazing. So he went to North Carolina AT State, joined the Warriors in 1960, was selected in the 1960 draft. Let's see. Adels was. Where's Al Adels? 39th overall by the Warriors in the fifth round. Okay. Not bad, so fifth round. Okay, there we go. Fifth round, 39th overall pick because, well, there are only eight teams in the NBA. So, yeah, he went into the fifth round. We're in number 16. Scored. Yeah, it was funny because when Will Chamberlain scored 100 points with the Warriors against the Knicks, it says Hershey, Pennsylvania. Will Chamberlain and Al Adels combined for 117 points last night as the Warriors beat the Knicks 169 147. Which was funny because Wilt scored 100 points and the second leading scorer was Adels with 17. But hey, Adels was in the headlines. And he played for the Warriors from 1960 to 1971. And no other team. He was the rare one team player. Like I know Jerry West, Bill Russell, and Larry Bird, among others. And Magic Johnson did that too. But yeah, he was a member of the Warriors for many years. He was a role player for the 64 Warriors team. And went to the 67 championship for the Warriors against the Sixers, but lost. In the one championship that Boston didn't win between 1958, well, from 1959 to 1969, the Celtics only missed one championship, and that was 67 when the Sixers did it. For the Warriors, I feel bad for Al Adels not getting an NBA ring as a player. He was head coach. Oh. Anyway, he retired as a player in 77 and stayed on head coach, helping them beat the Bullets, making him the second African-American coach to win the NBA title. Bill Russell was player coach for the Celtics. They almost got to the NBA Finals against the Celtics in 76, but lost to the Suns in Game 7. Achilles actually torn his Achilles tendon as a coach and had missed 21 games. So he coached until the Warriors... He is the longest serving coach in Warriors history and the most wins in franchise history. Are you serious? He has more than Steve Kerr? Well, he spent in hospice care at 87 years old. Five In the regular season, 8.9 points per game in 711 games with the Warriors franchise. As a head coach, got them to the Conference Finals in 73, the NBA Tales in 75, Conference Finals in 76. So 557 wins. That's still number one? Doesn't Steve Kerr have more wins? Five hundred fifty seven. Oh, he only has five hundred nineteen. Well, he's forty away from Al Adels' record. So yeah. Oops, change that. All right. So, in honor of Al Adels, we have the 1962 Knicks taking on the 1962 Warriors in Philadelphia. Now, there are some changes because, in actuality, Al Adels it wasn't really a starter. Paula Raisin was. But, I put Al Adels in the starting lineup because it's Al freaking Adels. I'm like, he should be in the starting lineup for this game. Well, I was like, Guy Rogers, Tom Gola, Tom Meshery, and Wilt the Still Chamberlain. They take on the Knicks, who have Al Butler, Richie Guerin, Will Willie Nels, John Green, and Daryl Imhoff. Remember him, the Philly fans? He's the guy that um, one of the four players the Lakers traded to the Sixers in 1967 to get Wilt the Still Chamberlain. 
So anyway, let's tip off. Next for the ball first. Last break. Hold up. M off fouls Chamberlain, who goes to the line and makes one out of two. Goal over the steal, fast break. But Noel steals it back. Okay, fast break shot. No, flip shot by Butler. Yes, Butler makes the two. Garen with the steal. Fast break, fast break shot. Yes, Knowles. And Chamberlain scores. Gola with the assist. Gola will pick up a foul. New York with the pass. Garen misses the shot. Chamberlain misses the shot. Gola misses. Chamberlain takes a shot. Good and gets Imhoff to foul him. Phil Jordan will come in to play center. And Chamberlain makes a three-point play. Knowles with the shot. Good. And Mishery makes the shot. Rogers with the assist. Butler misses the shot. Butler, Mishery. The hoop. And he misses. Mishery had the ball right in there. Butler makes the bucket. He's got four. Rogers good. Gola with the assist. Knowles now has six points. A foul, not so much. Philly with the pass. A block, Gola will take the shot and flip it in for two. Chamberlain with the block, and Adel's out for a reason. So we'll take an AP break. See if Adel comes back in the final three minutes. Okay, well, he's not going to come back. We might as well replay the first bird. Butcher makes a bucket. 28-23 Philly. And Luckabill misses a shot. Shot missed. Blocked by Garen. Technical foul by York Lorese. So Garen will take the technical shot. Adels will come in for Lorese. Who's one technical away from booted. Butler comes in for Butcher. The Butler, the Butcher, the candlestick maker. Looking Bell with a loose ball foul, so Johnny Green comes in for Whitey Martin. Adels will go to shooting guard to get Guy Rogers back in. Butler misses the shot. Buckner with the loose ball foul. That's Cleveland Buckner, not Quinn Buckner. Jordan with the foul on Chamberlain. We'll go to the line and make both free throws. Unusual. Oops. Chamberlain doesn't do this. Chamberlain with a block. Jordan slam dunks. Chamberlain bonks him. Jordan will go to the line for three. You got it. And Ariza misses a shot. Garen makes a shot. Ariza to Rogers. Buckner makes a shot for Green. Sorry about that. Anyway, Philly. Adels makes the bucket. Yay! Adels has a bucket. Chamberlain with a steal, and Luckenbell passes Chamberlain the ball, who's got 16. You know how good freaking Will to steal is. Archers with a steal. Fast break. Hold up. Eight seconds left. A reason throws the ball away. Here comes a chance. He makes the bucket. It's 36 33 Philly after one quota. Let's take a look at Al Adels' stats. At the Philadelphia Civic Center. Adels, six minutes, 12 seconds. One chance at the ball. Good. His plus minus is zero, meaning that he spent he was on the court for as many points as his team scored than his opponents did. No rebounds. No, nothing. One turnover, though. So, Adels didn't really do that much. 16 points by Will the Stilt. Measury has six. So, Will the Stilt's got 16. The highest for the Nick is eight for Willie Knowles. Let's see what Adels can do. That he could do. A bucket. He's got four. Reason will pick up another foul. Buckner comes in for green. Knowles will go to the line. I'm actually surprised that Reason's not taken out of the game. Because of the second foul. Chamberlain makes a bucket. Rogers with the assist. Buckner with the steal. Fast break. No foul. Chamberlain makes the bucket. Rogers with the assist. Chamberlain's already got 20. He is. 
And Jordan makes a bucket. Up there with a steal. Butler misses the shot. Adams will pick up the rebound. And Reason makes the bucket. Gary makes a shot for New York. Full court. And Chamberlain passes Luck and Bell the assist. Short end, second turnover. Green comes in for Buckner. Blocked by Jordan. Fortunately, that was a block and not goaltending. And A flips in for the seventh point of the day. Adels passes well. The reason makes the bucket. He's got eight. I present shot. No. Garen takes the shot. Left and Bell will pick up his second foul. And Green will miss the free throw. The chance for a three-point play. Chamberlain will go to the line. Jordan, second foul. Mishery comes in for Luck and Bill. Why is they not taking Jordan out? He's got two fouls. Chamberlain and Adels got 22 points. Adels turns the ball over. Bad luck. And Garen takes a bucket. Chamberlain misses. Mishery swats the ball out of bounds. Knowles will pick up foul number three, so Cleveland Buckner comes back in, so Knowles got to be careful because he's halfway to be his moment. Rare play. Oh! What the? Chamberlain's on the floor! Chamberlain's on the floor! Butler nails him. Al Butler and Philly will now have to take Will Chamberlain out. Who are they going to put in his place? Luck and Bill will have to come in. Wow! That changes the game right there. Butler is going to get butlered over. Me thinks. So Chamberlain in 17 minutes before he got hurt. 8 for 13 from the field. 6 for 7 from the free throw line. That's not Will Chamberlain numbers. 5 rebounds. Assist. A foul. 2 steals. 3 blocks. 22 points. Now I smell trouble. If you're a Sixer, I mean Warrior, right. The Warriors, not the Sixers. My fault. Green makes the bucket. A reason misses the shot, and Lincoln Bell will pick up foul number three. So Joe Rucklick will have to come in. I, yeah. High percentage shot by Green? No. Other misses the shot? No. Rucklick misses his shot. Especially with the block. And Rucklick with the foul on Jordan, who makes one. Billy only up at two. Prospect shot, no. Foul, no. Rogers with the foul. Bud comes in for Jordan at center. Butler to the line. Makes two free throws. Warrior fans, boo. Boo. Because it was Butler's high pick that hurt Chamberlain for the game. A reason's not got 10 points. And Butler makes a shot. Mishery with the foul. Imhoff comes in for Bud. Gola comes in for Ariza and look at Bill for Rucklick. And Buckner misses the free throw. Bud comes in for Buckner. Rogers turns the ball over. The Knicks get the ball, but they can't do anything about it. Carrying with the steal. Pass break. No. Flip shot. No. Ola now has four points. Butler's got ten. Ola gives Rogers the ball. Rogers for a three-point play as Butler makes the shooting foul and he misses. Garen picks up an offensive foul. Ball back to Philly. Butler turns the ball over. Ola misses Adels with an offensive foul. That's his first. Rogers' his second foul, putting Butler to the line with only one free throw. Gotta tie the game. And Lucky Bell makes a shot, Rogers' his assist, and Philly's now up by three. Adels with a steal. Fast break. And he puts it in three for three today. Six points. Now he has a chance to shine. He makes the bucket. Butler steals that ball. Fast break. And Green puts it in. 60 59. Gola makes a shot, measure the assist. Adels with another steal. That's right. Gola with a shot. No. Couldn't do it. 
Rare play. Ooh, two ball. Traveling. Make sure he turns the ball over for traveling. And Mishri will pick up his second foul. Three to the line. That's two. Rogers turns the ball over again. He might take last shot. Garen misses the shot. Last break. Rogers puts it in. Last chance for New York. Bud makes the shot. 64-63 is your score after one half. Remember, this is where no three pointers would will be attempted. Of course. So Will Chamberlain, in 17 minutes, he was doing well, and then he just had to get hurt thanks to Al Butler. Uh, so Al Adels has played 18 minutes, 12 seconds <clears throat> of action. Three for three from the line, I mean from the field. Minus two plus minus, so he was on the court for two more New York points than Philly points. One defensive rebound, one assist, one foul, two steals, four turnovers, so. That's not how a guard should be. But the Sixers are winning. Narrowly, though. Make sure he makes this a shot. And Rogers picks up foul number three. He's halfway to mean DQ'd. Green misses the shot. Adel's good. He's four for four today. Green with an offensive foul. Rogers again with a turnover right off the bat. And Garrett now puts in 10 points. Luck and Bill to the line. Imhoff's third foul. One for Luck and Bill. Now, even number. Luck and Bill will still the well. A big shot. Good. Luck and Bill. Goal on with the assist. So Luck and Bill being the center. Adels will pick up his second foul, but that does not mean the hook. Green with his second foul for New York. Measuring to the line. Makes two. And Knowles misses the shot. Green starts steal. Imhoff has fourth foul, so then we'll have to come in. So Imhoff is in trouble. Adels will move to point guard. York Laras comes in. So Adels is still in the game, so we'll keep everything going. And Jordan makes 10 points. Look at Bill. A block by Green. A reason's got the ball. He puts it in. It's well, freaking a reason. After all, Jordan makes the shot. He's at 12. Look at Bill. Fourth foul. Knowles comes in for Bud. That should be a page of thing. Lucky Bill out for Rucklick. Well, Lucky Bill might be careful because, well, go up with the third foul in green. He's going to make the shot good. He better be careful because Philly doesn't have Will Chamberlain. He got hurt earlier in the game. This is all make believe. Adels, good. Five for five. What guts? Will I with the steal? Oh, but he misses the shot this time. Why did I have to do that? Rucklick, Adels will take a shot. Yes, this time he's made it. He's got six field goals. Goal with his fourth foul. He'll be taken out for the Warriors for Radovich. Green to the line. And makes one. So he's still up by four. And a reason misses the shot. Rucklick with the block. But the Knicks get the ball back. Knowles misses the shot. Radovich misses. Rucklick puts it in. 79-73. Adels with his third foul. He will stay there. Surprisingly, Butler will make one for two. A reason puts back his shot and makes it seven point lead. And Knowles picks up foul number four. So Bud has to come in for the Knicks. No Philly changes. And... The Reese makes the bucket. Rucklick misses. Philly probably would have definitely went with Wilt a lot more than normal. Well, like normal, I guess. But with the personal foul. Adels passes to Radovich, who makes it in. So second assist for Adels today. Jordan's got 14 points. Three throws from the Reese after Garen's second foul. And a double miss. Fortunately for him, Rutlick gets the offensive rebound. And the reason now has 16 points. Garrett now has 12. He throws from Rutlick. Adels will go back to shooting guard. Guy Rogers to point guard. Rutlick. Nope, Adels for, out for the race. So we'll auto play to the end of the third quarter because. Oh, that 
Adels is not coming back. The, the Warriors are up by only three points, though. Let's take a look at everything. So, 18 points by Johnny Green, 18 points by Phil Jernand. New York's got five guys in double digits. Imhoff, no points in nine minutes. He was the center. Imhoff, Knowles, and Jernan have four fouls each. As do Maitre, Gola, Rogers, and Luckenbill for the Warriors. Al Adels has three fouls. 27 minutes of play, the most minutes by a Warrior. Six for seven from the field, plus six differentials, so, you know, that's good. Two rebounds, two assists, three personal fouls, two steals, four turnovers, 12 points. He is third in points behind Wilt 22 and Reasons 18. It's kind of crazy because, you know, Wilt has been out for a quarter and a bit. And he's still the highest point total point getter. Imagine if Chamberlain was healthy. Knowles foul number five, so Buckner will have to come in. Knowles not too pleased. And I'm not too pleased because of the fact that no out adults. Rogers will pick up foul number five. A reason comes in. I'm surprised they don't put adults in. Karen's going to got 20 points. We have a tie. Measure with the steal. Fast break. Gola, good. Reason with foul number three for him. Darren makes the bucket and finally the Knicks take the lead. High percentage shot. No. Buckner makes the shot. Bought by Gola and Philly will get the team. We got Whitey Martin comes in for Karen. Sixers get Addles back on the court for Larise. L time. Might need Addles time. Buckner with the steal though. And Lucky Bell will pick up foul number five. Butler comes in for Butcher. So Lucky Bell will be out. Rucklet comes in. See what happens when you don't have Will Chamberlain to deal with? The Sixers are like. I mean, the Knicks are like, yeah, we got this. Rucklick makes the shot. Down to two. A shot, and Bud flips it in. But there's a pass. Measure makes the bucket. Addles with the big assist on Measure for 10 points. Garen and Green come back in for the Knicks. And a reason picks up foul number four. And it makes a steal fast break. Gola makes the shot. Nizer. Garen misses the shot. Garen will pick up foul number three. Rucklick, foul number four. Garen misses the shot. Adams misses the shot. Rucklick will force Imhoff to pick up foul number five. So Jordan has to come in. So Rucklick, two shots. Just makes one, but it's better than zero. One's better than zero. Butler with the turnover. So there's a chance. Can't get it. Go low with the steal. That's break. Make sure he's good. He's got 12. Back look with the steal. Fast break. Gola makes the bucket. And make sure he will pick up number five. Green with the points. So Green will go to the line. Make sure he out for Radovich because he's got five fouls. Green to tie the game. You bet. Ruckluck misses the shot. A reason with the steal. And a foul. A reason picks up foul number five. Buckner for Bud. Karen to untie the game. Larise comes in for a reason. And he can't. Garen cannot untie it. Gola misses the shot. Adels picks up the rebound. And Larise scores. 110-108 Philly. Jordan makes the shot. He's at 20. Right out of edge offensive foul. Knowles and Einhoff will come in for the Knicks. Adels goes to shooting guard, taking out Larese. So Rogers in. Emhoff, good. Finally makes a bucket at it. Gola passes to Rogers. He's good. 
Make sure we foul number six. Da 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 da. He's out of the game. Green will take two shots and make both. New York by two with minute forty-eight. Adels. What could he do? Pass the ball. Low percent shot. Good by Rogers. Good job by Adels. His fourth assist. We're tied. But Knowles makes the shot. Rutledge misses a shot. Loose ball fell. Luck and Bill. So he's gone. That's two Warriors gone. Da, 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 da. Because of the common foul, the Warriors are at the penalty. So Imhoff will go to the line for two and make one. And the three point rule doesn't exist. Green with the block. It works. Butler makes a shot. It looks like Alice's parade has been rained upon. Gola makes the shot. Casual foul. Butler hits it. Philly doesn't have the time. Get rid with the steal. Knicks will take the timeout and will get revenge. Well, if it was intentional. Rogers will pick up foul number six. So that's the third warrior to foul out of the game. So Philly just can't believe they let Martin to the line. His first point of the game. And Recklick, loose ball foul. So I think that means free throws. Green will take the free throws. Make them both. And that's it. The New York Knickerbockers use a great job. Everyone, Bill Smith and Sam Steffi, have been playing. To a final score of 122-116. Great job by the Knicks. 25 from Johnny Green, your leader. 22 from Richie Guerin and 20 from Phil Jordan. Philly, well, Chamberlain played only 17 minutes, but he got 22 points. Still the most. 18 by Paul Reason, 16 by Tom Gola. The man of the hour, Al Adels, 36 minutes played. The most by a Warrior player. 6 for 8 from the field. Plus four differential, which was pretty good, but not the best. Three defensive rebounds, four assists, three fouls, two steals, four turnovers, 12 points. Not half bad for Al Adams, who I stuck into the starting lineup. But 122-116 is your score. See the recap. You see Will Chamberlain played only 17 minutes. He still had the most points with 22 for the Sixers, for the Warriors. I keep making that mistake. And I think what I think Chamberlain definitely would have had a forty point game if the if he didn't get hurt. And basically the Knicks gotta thank the lucky stars that Chamberlain got hurt in the second quarter. Because if it wasn't for that. Yeah, Chamberlain. Two for two. And then Chamberlain got injured with seven minutes left in the game. And then they had to put Luck and Bill in. If it wasn't for that injury, I think the Knicks were in trouble. And Will Chamberlain would have beaten the tar out of the Knicks. But the Knicks win 122-116. I'm sorry, Al Adels. I feel bad for you. And if the 75 season was there, I would have done 75 Warriors Bullets rematch. But yeah, the Knicks win the Al Adels tribute game. Fuck you, your Knicks. Fuck you, Green. But yeah, that's what happens. The Knicks win. Rest in peace, Al Adels. I'm Jeff Diamond Adu.